Hi everyone, Niall here from LearnToTradeTheMarket.com. Welcome to today's Forex training video. We're looking at set and forget order strategies. This is where you can enter a trade and simply walk away and you'll either be stopped out or your limit order to take profit will be filled. It's a very simple trading strategy and we use the price action signals to alert us to the trading opportunities. We then place a limit order to enter or a market order to enter. We place a stop loss and then we place a uh, conditional order to cancel the stop loss if the profit target is hit. Basically, uh, most broker platforms do offer this facility. Now, I'm not going to go over how to place the trades in the broker platforms because everyone is using different platforms. What I want to do is go over how you might trade a price action signal using a set and forget strategy. It's a very easy thing to understand. I've actually expanded writing an article on this uh, set and forget forex trading strategy you can see the article link below this video if you'd like to read that and I'm just going to talk about the price action reversal which alerted me to a trade here on the GBP JBY daily candlestick chart now we have the downtrend in place we have identified the bias as being bearish and you can see the market has broken this 147 level and then retested it on several occasions. What I've then done is identified the price action signal here which terminated uh, an upward move at 147. It was a nice bearish reversal pin bar, a very simple reversal bar. The way that I've entered here is to place a sell on limit at 146. Now that is halfway between the range of that signal bar that allowed a tight stop loss placement above 147.20. You can see this logical level here, a nice area for a stop loss above that level. So let's say we have a 130 point stop loss, that is this distance here. The set and forget strategy is to enter at limit and then place the stop loss order and place a conditional order to take profit at two times what we've risked. So if we've risked 130 pips, we're looking to make 260 simply two times what we've risked. That's the minimum distance for a set and forget order strategy. Now the market did sell off into the uh, weekend. We had uh, a gap down and it filled the order. So entering on the Thursday we had 48 hours um, of trading activity before the take profit order was actually executed. So the idea here is to let the market do its thing. You walk away and you set your orders and forget the trade. If you sit there and watch the market and watch the screens, you'll do your head in and it will be an emotional drama. The idea is to take yourself away from the market, do something else, and then the emotion is removed and that anxiety to watch the position or alter the trades is just completely removed. And it's something that I do a lot on the daily charts. That's why I promote trading the, the uh, daily time frames and the four hour time frames and trading price action without any indicators, keeping it really simple. It can be done. I do it for a living and I, I try to push this idea of walking away from the market and letting the market do its thing. Coming back at the New York close, that's when the Wall Street market closes. It's when the Forex market closes around the same time. And uh, in Australia, it's perfect because you can just basically wake up in the morning and look at your chart and that's the perfect time when all this is occurring. In America, it's probably also quite a perfect scenario because you can get home from work, turn on the screen and it's just as everybody is basically wrapping up business for the day that the Forex market closes. And that's a great time to look for these signals then you can basically set your limit order to enter, place your stop loss and then your take profit target and again, I call it the set and forget strategy. It's not an original concept, the actual method that we're using there. Where my original concept comes in is where you're trading my price action signals using this whole set and forget style trading method. Now, if you'd like to learn more, you can check out the article that I've written below. Now, if you'd like to learn more about what we're doing here at Learn to Trade the Market, you can check out the Forex Trading Course tab on the website. Things that are offered there are Forex Trading Course, Forex daily price action commentary and a Forex trading forum. It's a lifetime membership. The cost is less than a losing trade. I'm sure you'll enjoy it and get value for money. I'd like to see you in the members section soon. Take care and I hope you enjoyed today's video.